Hello, good morning and welcome to Washington DC. This is a hike with the difference. Today I am hiking along with many of my colleagues of the American Ambulance Association around the corridors of power to talk about some legislative issues that are affecting us in the ambulance industry. So on my agenda today, uh, I've already had meetings with the office of Diane Feinstein and Kamala Harris, Senators from California. And we're talking about a number of things that affect us in the ambulance industry, from the reimbursement, the add-ons uh, for urban, rural and super rural, and also for the uh, Surprise and Balance Billing Act, which is something that's uh, gathering quite a head of steam uh, all the way from Congress down to local areas. So once we're inside, all of the congressmen are based in offices off these large corridors. And so you can just knock and walk right in. This is a public building and therefore the public and the people of the United States have open access to their elected officials. Once you go through the metal detectors of course. Congressional hearing on the budget is in session. If you ever watched a politician give an interview on CNN or Fox News, then they're doing it from this very spot here. This is in Cannon House, and it's the rotunda, and it's the place where all the news crews are set up to interview the nearest and dearest politician of the hour. So if you're here to talk about congressional waste, this is the place you come to. Underneath the corridors of power, are the tunnels of power and there is a whole subterranean world that runs underneath the Senate and the Congress to allow you to get from A to B to C to D to Z all underground without going outside and again once you're in and you're through the security screen then you are free to wander the corridors and tunnels of power once you've done the corridors of power the tunnels of power we then come to the engine room with a thing that's powering everything. Power rings. Yes, you should. So, what we've got here is uh, the American Ambulance Association Central Headquarters during our legislative visit to the Hill. And uh, Aidan is with me, so uh, Hello, how, many pe how many people are you organising, who are we seeing, and most importantly, what are we going to achieve today? Sure, so we probably have um, close to 35, 35 or 40 um, AAA volunteer leaders in town meeting with over 60 different congressional Shameless offices. Shameless plug, there you go. Uh, we're Two advocating tickets. for ambulance priorities for the industry and mobile health care. So if you've never been to the Hill before, and you've never been lobbying before, uh, organisations such as the American Ambulance Association make it really easy for you by hooking you up with your locally elected official up here on the Hill, uh, from both the Senate and the Congress side, um, by preparing what we call Leave Behind Packs, which is a pack that contains all the key information on the legislation that we're on the Hill talking about. So today we're talking about balanced billing, and we're also talking about um, the various add-ons that help fund and finance our industry. And so once you meet your official, then you can leave the information behind, always get their business card, always leave your business card, and that way you can communicate with each other on the legislation that's ongoing as it goes. to have everybody here and uh, thanks for making the trip. What about your meetings? How'd they go? Uh, well, I've, I've been to the office of Kamala Harris and mm -hmm. Diane Feinstein and uh, all good Californians and uh, 
also uh, Eric Swalwell, who's actually my local constituency elected official. Nice. And okay. so we were able to talk hiking and wine okay. and legislation. Did you see him? No. Oh, just that. Yeah. I saw a photograph of him. Okay. But yeah. I, more importantly, I saw the staff, and the reason we're here, of course, I saw the staffers good, good. who were able to actually yeah. leave the leave behind yeah. and also convey the message. Awesome.